merciful God, I have such need of your mercy now. Not for myself, but for my knights, for this is truly their hour of need. Deliver them from the trials ahead, and I will repay you a thousandfold with any sacrifice you ask of me. And if in your wisdom, you should determine that that sacrifice must be my life for theirs, so that they may once again taste the freedom that has so long been denied to them, I will gladly make that covenant. My death will have a purpose. I ask no more than that. Why do you always talk to God and not to me? Well, pray to whomever you pray that we don't cross the Saxons. My faith is what protects me, Lancelot. Why do you challenge this? I don't like anything that puts a man on his knees. No man fears to kneel before the God he trusts. Without faith, without belief in something, what are we? To try and get past the woads in the north is insanity. Them we fought before. Not north of the wall! How many Saxons? Hmm? How many? Tell me. Do you believe in this mission? These people need our help. It is our duty to bring them out. I don't care about your charge. And I don't give a damn about Romans, Britain, or this island. If you desire to spend eternity in this place, Arthur, so be it. But suicide cannot be chosen for another. And yet you choose death for this no, family. No, I choose life and freedom for myself and the men. How many times in battle have we snatched victory from the jaws of defeat? Outnumbered, outflanked, yet still we triumph. With you at my side, we can do so again. Lancelot, we are knights. What other purpose do we serve if not for such a cause? Arthur, you fight for a world that will never exist. Never. There will always be a battlefield. I will die in battle. Of that, I'm certain. And hopefully a battle of my choosing. But, if it be this one, grant me a favor. Don't bury me in our sad little cemetery. Burn me. Burn me and cast my ashes to a strong east wind. <laughs> 